to, there is the queen size bed. And over here, here is the front door. There. Over here is a closet. Safe, iron, ironing board, and luggage rack. And some hangers. Okay, so not bad, especially for one person. And this is the bathroom door, sort of translucent. Let's go in here and take a look. This is a little bit different. Uh, let's look down. If you'll notice, this is not a tub shower. There is barely, barely a lip here. In fact, yeah, it just sort of angles up a little bit. Um, so that's a little bit different. Um, they've got shower gel and shampoo bottles on the wall. Soap and lotion here next to the sink. Air dryer. It looks like I might be in a handicapped room. Um, that's fine. If they didn't have any handicapped uh, guests, then uh, I guess that's okay. They put me in here. I would be interested to see what the other bathrooms are like. So let's take a look here. Full length mirror over here. Table next to the bed with standard outlets. And these are like ethernet cable outlets. I guess if you were going to plug a computer in there, I don't know if there's a network that's attached to that or not. Uh, not something I'm going to be using. Um, lamp. Here's our bed. Across from it, a cabinet with a smallish flat screen television. Let's look inside. Oh, nice and big in there. You could probably put one of your empty bags in there if you decided to completely unpack your bags. Yeah, lots of space there. Um, I paid just a little bit more so I could have a microwave and small refrigerator in my room. Seems like I don't know, I might be bringing back some leftover food here and there. Here's our window. That's kind of nice. That's very New York City, isn't it? <laughs> Fire escape across to some brick buildings. I just need a saxophone and an old cat. I have stood on a New York City fire escape. Um, that's that's a bucket list item, right? <laughs> that's that's something you you got to do at least once in your life. Uh, I'm counting that as a real positive for Hotel Forty Six. Gives you the opportunity to stand on a New York City fire escape. Awesome. Uh, oops. 
<laughs> All right, so I guess I wasn't supposed to do that. Over here, there's a wall sconce with a light like that and a reading light. That'll come in handy. I'll probably do a little bit of reading while I'm here. And here is a clock with an alarm. But notice on top, not only does it have some standard outlet plugs, but look, it's got some HDMI charging stations as well. That's good. Um, I'm guessing that's something that they added after the fact they say hey here's something we can do to help people because you know let's be honest lots of people recharge using these things instead of these things nowadays so it's good for them to have them here is the ac unit sort of a uh a window unit here that's pretty typical in a big old city like this so anyway, decent room. I'm gonna be here for five nights.